faith. The Baha'i Faith We are cognizant of thy righteous deeds, though they shall avail thee nothing. For the whole object of such righteousness is but recognition of God, thy Lord, and undoubted faith in the words revealed by him. Selections from the Writings of the Bab O children of men, if ye believe in the one true God, follow me, this most great remembrance of God sent forth by your Lord, that he may graciously forgive you your sins. Verily, he is forgiving and compassionate toward the concourse of the faithful. Selections from the Writings of the Bab Likewise is the revelation of him whom God shall make manifest among the lowly servants whom no one would imagine to be of any merit, how great the number who will be honored with true faith, and on whom the fountainhead of generosity will bestow the robe of authority. For whatever is created in the faith of God is created through the potency of his word. Selections from the writings of the Bob. Man's higher station, however, is attained through faith in God in every dispensation, and by acceptance of what hath been revealed by him, and not through learning. Inasmuch as in every nation there are learned men who are versed in diverse sciences, nor is it attainable through wealth, for it is similarly evident that among the various classes in every nation there are those possessed of riches. Likewise are other transitory things. Selections from the Writings of the Bar Know thou that every ear which hearkeneth unto his words with true faith shall be immune from the fire. Whatever one gaineth in the life to come is but the fruit of this faith. Selections from the Writings of the Bar Indeed, any man whose eye gazeth upon his words with true faith well deserveth paradise and one whose conscience beareth witness unto his words with true faith shall abide in paradise and attain the presence of God. And one whose tongue giveth utterance to his words with true faith shall have his abode in paradise, wherein he will be seized with ecstasy in praise and glorification of God the ever-abiding, whose revelations of glory never end, and the reviving breaths of whose holiness never fail. Selections from the Writings of the Bob By the might of my Lord, verily, the Lord will assist only those who will remain firm in his cause and desire union, love, humility, and submissiveness, and to become separated from aught else save God. Tablets of Abdul Baha Buddhism Bhagavat said, Faith is in this world the best property for a man. Dharma well observed conveys happiness. Truth indeed is the sweetest of things. And that life they call the best, which is lived with understanding. Dharma means true teaching. Holy Sutta Nipata What was prepared for them and placed as food at the door they thought was to be given to those that seek for what has been prepared by faith. Holy Sutta Nipata Bhagavat, having abandoned the objects of the five senses, the beautiful, the charming, and gone out from thy house with faith, do thou put an end to pain. Holy Sutta Nipata When one's mind is not steadfast, when one knows not the good teaching and one's faith wavers, one's wisdom will not be perfected. Holy Dhammapada The person who is without blind faith, who knows the uncreate, who has severed all links, who has destroyed all causes for karma, good and evil, and who has thrown out all desires, that person truly is the most excellent of people. Karma means retribution. Holy Dhammapada Be strenuous, be filled with spiritual yearning. By faith and moral purity, by effort and meditation, by investigation of the truth, by being rich in knowledge and virtue, and by being mindful, 
destroy this unlimited suffering. Only Dhammapada. People give according to their faith or regard. If one becomes discontented with the food and drink given by others, one does not attain meditative absorption, either by day or by night. Holy Dhammapada. One who is full of faith and virtue and possesses good repute and wealth, that person is respected everywhere in whatever land one travels. Holy Dhammapada. Good is virtue until life's end. Good is faith that is steadfast. Good is the acquisition of wisdom. And good is the avoidance of evil. Holy Dhammapada. Full of joy, full of faith in the teaching of the Buddha, the monk attains the peaceful state, the bliss of cessation of conditioned things. Holy Dhammapada. Let a man worship the Buddhas, honoring them always with faith. From that comes this preeminent merit, as is declared by the Ginas, Holy Mahayana Texts. Those who are filled with faith and being free from doubt amass a stock of merit in order to be born in the world Sukhavati and conceive, believe and trust in the perfect knowledge of the blessed Buddhas they, being born miraculously, appear sitting cross-legged in the flowers of the lotus. Holy Mahayana Texts Now and then a man is found, now and then a Buddha appears. Knowledge of the object of faith is acquired after a long time. Therefore one should strive to acquire the knowledge of the object of faith. Holy Mahayana Texts a bodhisattva, O Subhuti, who believes that all things are without self, he has faith. He is called a noble-minded bodhisattva by the holy and fully enlightened Tathagata. Bodhisattva means spiritual practitioner. Tathagata means Buddha. Holy Mahayana texts. Gaudai. Faith strengthens our will. Faith is the basis for the immortals and Buddhas. Faith is the Dharma boat carrying us to paradise. Faith, if unwavering, the practitioners will surely attain enlightenment. Faith is the ladder. With it, one climbs easily to the heavenly abode. Dharma means true teaching. The teaching of the three vehicles. Christianity as the scripture says, anyone who trusts in him will never be put to shame. Holy Bible. But apart from faith, it is impossible to please him well. For whosoever comes to God must believe that he is and that he has, for those who seek him earnestly, rewards in store. Holy Bible. He was absolutely sure that God would be able to do what he had promised. Holy Bible. What is faith? It is the confident assurance that something we want is going to happen. It is the certainty that what we hope for is waiting for us, even though we cannot see it up ahead. Holy Bible. Become earnest about the word. For as to the word, its first part is faith, the second love, the third works, for from these comes life. For the word is like a grain of wheat. When someone had sown it, he had faith in it, and when it had sprouted, he loved it, because he had seen many grains in place of one. And when he had worked, he was saved, because he had prepared it for food, and again he left some to sow so also can you yourselves receive the kingdom of heaven. Unless you receive this through knowledge, you will not be able to find it. The Nag Hammadi Library But the Lord answered and said to us, I have given you faith many times. Moreover, I have revealed myself to you, James, and you all have not known me. Now again I see you rejoicing many times, and when you are elated at the promise of life, are you yet sad, and do you grieve when you are instructed in the kingdom? But you, through faith and knowledge, 
have received life. The Nag Hammadi Library But if there is one who does not believe, he does not have the capacity to be persuaded. For it is the domain of faith, my son, and not that which belongs to persuasion. The dead shall arise. The Nag Hammadi Library It is he, the Father, who gave root impulses to the eons, since they are places on the path which leads toward him, as toward a school of behavior. He has extended to them faith in and prayer to him, whom they do not see, and a firm hope in him, of whom they do not conceive, and a fruitful love which looks toward that which it does not see, and an acceptable understanding of the eternal mind, and a blessing which is riches and freedom, and a wisdom of the one who desires the glory of the Father for his thought. The Nag Hammadi Library Confucianism The Master said, Hold faithfulness and sincerity as first principles, and be moving continually to what is right. This is the way to exalt one's virtue. The Confucian Analects The Essenes Many there are who would stay in the tranquil valley of ignorance, where children play and butterflies dance in the sun for their short hour of life. But none can tarry there long, and ahead rise the somber mountains of learning, Many there are who fear to cross, and many there are who have fallen bruised and bleeding from their steep and rugged slopes. But faith is the guide over the gaping chasm, and perseverance the foothold in the jagged rocks. Beyond the icy peaks of struggle lies the peace and beauty of the infinite garden of knowledge, where the meaning of the law is made known to the children of light. The Essene Gospel of Peace Hinduism A Rick verse declares, This knowledge of Brahman should be told to those only who have performed the necessary duties, who are versed in the Vedas and devoted to Brahman, and who, full of faith, have offered oblations in the Akashi fire, and performed according to rule the right of carrying fire on the head. The Kashi is a form of sacred fire. Mundaka Upanishad. But those who seek the self through austerity, chastity, faith, and knowledge travel by the northern path and win the sun. The sun, verily, is the support of all lives. He is immortal and fearless. He is the final goal. Thence they do not return. This path is blocked for the ignorant. Prasna Upanishad. The Rick verses led him to the world of men. By practicing austerity, chastity, and faith, he enjoys greatness. Prasna Upanishad He created prana. From prana, faith, space, air, fire, water, earth, the organs, mind, food. From food, virility, austerity, the Vedic hymns, sacrifice, the worlds and in the worlds he created names. Prana means life-sustaining force. Prasna Upanishad Those even among householders who know this, as described, and those too who, living in the forest, meditate with faith upon the Satya Brahman, or Hiranyagaba, then a being created from the mind of Hiranyagaba comes and leads them to the worlds of Brahman, in those worlds of Brahma, they become exalted and live for many years. They return no more to this world. Here in Yagaba means the source of creation of the universe. Brihadaranyaka Upanishad Whatever is to be given should be given with faith, not without faith, according to one's plenty, with modesty, with fear, with sympathy. Ketyariya Upanishad this sheath of the mind is the embodied soul of the former. 
Verily, the difference from this sheath, which consists of the essence of the mind, but within it, is another self, which consists of the intellect. By this the former is filled. This too has the shape of a man, like the human shape of the former is the human shape of the latter. Faith is its head, what is right is its right wing, what is truth is its left wing, absorption is its trunk, mahat is its tail, its support. Mahat means the first principle of universal intelligence and consciousness. Taitariya Upanishad Work that is done with knowledge, faith, and the Upanishad, that is, meditation on the deities, produces more powerful fruit. Chandogya Upanishad He whose creation is the universe, who cherishes all desires, who contains all odors, who is endowed with all tastes, who embraces all this, who never speaks and who is without longing, he is myself within the heart. When I shall have departed, hence I shall certainly reach him. One who has this faith and has no doubt will certainly attain to that Godhead. Shandogya Upanishad When one has faith, only then does one reflect. One who does not have faith does not reflect. Only one who has faith reflects. One must desire to understand faith. Changdogya Upanishad When one is single-minded in one's devotion to the teacher, only then does one have faith. One who does not have single-mindedness does not have faith. Only one who has single-mindedness has faith. One must desire to understand single-mindedness. Shandogya Upanishad Have faith, my dearest, have faith. Don't let yourself be deluded in this. You are yourself the Lord, whose property is knowledge. You are beyond natural causation. The Ashtavakra Gita Hua Hao Buddhism In Buddhism, faith is the most essential. Having faith, good or bad, is all in the heart. With faith we may discover the clue to the highest dharma. Dharma means true teaching, illuminating the way. Lacking faith, one accomplishes nothing. Lacking sincerity, it is difficult to see the Buddha. To be successful in spiritual practice, complete faith one must have. Faith has infinite power. On faith one becomes a Buddha, a saint. If you have faith in your heart, then you won't abandon your practice midway. I advise all people thus, to practice a spiritual stance is a must, illuminating the way. Faith and sincerity must go hand in hand. Faith without sincerity, we can very easily be tempted by the bad spirits. If we have sincerity but lack faith in our philanthropic works, then that sincerity often dwindles away. Therefore, faith and sincerity must go hand in hand. Once we have faith and sincerity, then we use our wisdom to examine carefully the religious teaching that we're studying, or will study, to understand clearly our purpose. Verses of Divine Teaching Islam Those to whom men said, People have mustered against you, therefore fear them, but this only increased their faith, and they said, Sufficient for us is Allah, and an excellent guardian is He. Quran And who is better in faith than he who submits himself to Allah? And he is a doer of good, and follows the religion of Abraham, the upright. And Allah took Abraham for a special friend. Quran do they then seek the judgment of the days of ignorance? And who is better than Allah as a judge for a people who have firm faith? Quran And thus did we show Abraham the kingdom of the heavens and the earth, that he might be rightly guided, and that he might be of those who have certainty of faith. Quran 
true believers are only those whose hearts tremble when the name of Allah is mentioned, and when his signs are recited to them, they increase their faith, and who put their trust in their Lord, who observe prayer and spend out of that which we have provided for them. Quran Jainism Right faith, right knowledge, and right conduct together constitute the path to liberation. Belief in realities ascertained as they are is right faith. This right faith is attained by intuition or by acquisition of knowledge. Tatvarth Sutra Reverence to knowledge, faith, conduct, and the custom of homage are the four kinds of reverence. Tatvarth Sutra A religious order is accumulation of virtues. A religious order frees people from the pollution of karmas and conjoins together right faith, right knowledge, and right conduct. Karmas means retributions. Saman Sudam Sankasutra The great genas preach to their disciples that faith is the root of religion. Having heard that with your own ears, do not bow to one without faith. Genas are perfected beings. Ashta Pahuda They are lost whose faith is lost. Nirvana is not for one devoid of faith. One having blemishes of conduct may attain perfection, but not one with blemishes of faith. Ashta Pahuda Those who are without the gem of right faith may know all sorts of scripture, but being without realization, they keep wandering about. Ashta Pahuda Judaism The eyes of the Lord preserve him that hath knowledge, but he overthroweth the words of the faithless man. Tanakh That thy trust may be in the Lord, I have made them known to thee this day, even to thee. Tanakh Mormonism And behold, they were faithful until the end. Therefore they were saved. Book of Mormon Sikhism No paper, no pen, no scribe can record the state of the faithful. Such is the name of the Immaculate Lord. Only one who has faith comes to know such a state of mind. Sri Guru Granth Sahib The faithful have intuitive awareness and intelligence. The faithful know about all worlds and realms. The faithful do not have to go with the messenger of death. Such is the name of the Immaculate Lord. Only one who has faith comes to know such a state of mind. Sri Guru Granth Sahib The faithful find the door of liberation. The faithful uplift and redeem their family and relations. The faithful are saved and carried across with the Sikhs of the Guru. The faithful, O Nanak, do not wander around begging. Such is the name of the Immaculate Lord. Only one who has faith comes to know such a state of mind. Sri Guru Granth Sahib Let the remembrance of death be the patched coat you wear. Let the purity of virginity be your way in the world. And let faith in the Lord be your walking stick. See the brotherhood of all mankind as the highest order of yogis. Conquer your own mind and conquer the world. Sri Guru Granth Sahib Those who are imbued with the love of the name of the Lord are not loaded down by doubt. Sri Guru Granth Sahib Make good deeds the soil and let the word of the Shabbat be the seed. Irrigate it continually with the water of truth. Become such a farmer and faith will sprout. This brings knowledge of heaven and hell. Shabbat means essence of God. Sri Guru Granth Sahib They lose their faith. They have no understanding. Night and day they suffer in pain. The blind, self-willed mamuks do not even think of the Lord. They are drowned to death without water. 
O mind, vibrate and meditate forever on the Lord. Seek the protection of his sanctuary. Mamuks are those who follow their desires. Sri Guru Granth Sahib Sufism When you come to the pharmacist, they have sugar in abundance, but they see how much money you brought and give accordingly. By money is meant sincerity and faith. The words are imparted according to one's sincerity and faith. When you come seeking sugar, they examine your bag to see what its capacity is. Then they measure out accordingly, one bushel or two. But if someone brings a string of camels, they call the waymen to be of help. So someone comes along whom oceans do not satisfy. Another finds a few drops enough, and any more would be harmful. This applies not only to the world of ideas, sciences, and wisdom. It is true of everything. Fahi Ma Fahi, Discourses of Rumi. Taoism. In the highest antiquity, the people did not know that there were their rulers. In the next age, they loved them and praised them. In the next, they feared them. In the next, they despised them. Thus it was that when faith in the Tao was deficient in the rulers, a want of faith in them ensued in the people. How irresolute did those earliest rulers appear, showing by their reticence the importance which they set upon their words. Their work was done and their undertakings were successful while the people all said, We are as we are of ourselves. Tao Te Ching The life of the sage is like the action of heaven, and his death is the transformation common to all things. He does not indulge any anxious doubts. He does not lay plans beforehand. His light is without display. His good faith is without previous arrangement. His sleep is untroubled by dreams. His waking is followed by no sorrows. His spirit is guileless and pure. His soul is not subject to weariness. Vacant and without self-assertion, placid and indifferent, he agrees with the virtue of heaven. Ingrained Ideas Theosophy The unity of God, the immortality of the Spirit, belief in salvation only through our works, merit and demerit. Such are the principal articles of faith of the wisdom religion and the groundwork of Vedaism, Buddhism, Parsism, and such we find to have been even that of the ancient Osirism. When we, after abandoning the popular sun god to the materialism of the rebel, confine our attention to the books of Hermes, the thrice great. Isis unveiled. He who fully recognized the power of his immortal spirit and never doubted for one moment its omnipotent protection had not to fear. But woe to the candidate in whom the slightest physical fear, sickly child of matter, made him lose sight and faith in his own invulnerability. He who was not wholly confident of his moral fitness to accept the burden of these tremendous secrets was doomed. Isis unveiled. Seers, righteous men, who had attained to the highest science of the inner man and the knowledge of truth, have, like Marcus Antoninus, received instructions from the gods in sleep and otherwise. Helped by the purer spirits, those that dwell in regions of eternal bliss, they have watched the process and warned mankind repeatedly. Skepticism may sneer. Faith, based on knowledge and spiritual science, believes and affirms. Isis unveiled. Faith alone, unaccompanied by works, is reduced to naught in the Bhagavad Gita. This is unveiled. He saw good results in all religions and felt that whether a man be Buddhist, Christian, Mohammedan or Jew, his spiritual powers might equally be developed, his faith equally lead him to the highest truth. All he asked before making choice of a creed for his people was the evidence upon which to base faith. Isis unveiled. 
The human spirit is so great a thing that no man can express it. As God himself is eternal and unchangeable, so also is the mind of man. If we rightly understood its powers, nothing would be impossible to us on earth. The imagination is strengthened and developed through faith in our will. Faith must confirm the imagination, for faith establishes the will. This is unveiled. True faith is the embodiment of divine charity. Isis Unveiled Tibetan Buddhism Faith is the firm foundation of my house. Diligence forms the high walls. Meditation makes the huge bricks. And wisdom is the great cornerstone. With these four things I build my castle, and it will last as long as the truth eternal. Your worldly houses are delusions, mere prisons for the demons, and so I would abandon and desert them. Songs of Milarepa Like fog is faith unstable. When it starts to fade, you should strengthen it more than ever. Songs of Milarepa Until the autumn mists dissolve into the sky, strive on with faith and determination. Songs of Milarepa The Universal White Brotherhood What is death in the world? Death is the misfortune of the forgotten children, of children with no ideals. Resurrection? It is the promise to the children of high ideals who are coming out of the bottom of the cellars of the material world. In order to crawl out of such a cellar, you must have will, you must have unprecedented, incomparable faith. The High Ideal The moral power possessed by the disciples who follow the divine teaching lies in their absolute faith in God. We may not know where heaven is, where God lives, how far he is from us. We can only feel God. An English preacher said, I do not know where heaven is. But once I begin to pray to God, secretly in my soul, I feel the works of the Divine Spirit. So God hears him immediately. And that is the most important. The moment we turn our spirit to God, he hears us. The prophet was right when he said that God did not live in heaven, but in the hearts of the humble people. The Mindful Heart if you decide from now on to be faithful to the great law of divine manifestation, do you know what change will take place in you? If you observe the divine law, no matter what kind of person you meet on the road, even the worst one, when you stop and look at him, God will smile to you through him. You will say, I recognized him. God is hidden somewhere very deep, even in bad people. The Mindful Heart When you trust God, you also trust yourself. The faith in both God and yourself will lead you to the boundary of the Kingdom of God. Awakening of the Human Soul Zoroastrianism Of these twin spirits, the evil one chooses doing the worst, while the most bountiful Holy Spirit of goodness clothing itself in the imperishable heavens, chooses truth and righteousness. And so will those who would please Aru Mazda with righteous deeds, performed with faith in truth. Ahunibeti Gata Whoso shuns the evil liar and the mortals who deny the Lord, whoso reveres him the Most High through the holy faith of his appointed Saviour, to him, O Mazda, Shalt thou be a friend, brother, or even father? Ushtavaiti Gatha For more details, please visit www.suprememastertv.com forward slash w-o-w dash scrolls.